you if you want that dream vacation if you want that you know beautiful house if you want a lifestyle if you want that fancy car and if you yeah. want to make neighbors jealous of you don't believe and they'll also tell you don't believe people who will stop you because you need to have an open mind and the worst thing is people are borrowing money at high rates of interest they are borrowing from microfinance they are borrowing from banks many of these offices they don't have many of these companies don't have registered officers or employees when the founders enter they treat them like gods they mesmerize you they uh, they lead you to believe that you are going to become millionaires overnight they sold mattresses worth 5000 rupees for 1 lakh rupees people are losing money they are losing relationships like you said they don't see this as a serious problem at all there are other serious issues so we can't waste our time on you know or greedy people who have lost their money that's how they see victims in in hyderabad for instance one uh, it employee borrowed 20 lakhs and invested in qnet and he he couldn't face his family he committed suicide so from the government side we need a dedicated action and from people side they need to be aware because you say uh-huh. so many cases are in the judiciary also and these cases have gone to the high high courts have given judgments the reason for writing this book is uh, to get government to act against this because uh, this is no less a crime in fact it is a worse crime because if you are targeting the poorest of the poor people and making your millions out of this country and so much of money is going out of this country and uh, defense pe- people also have been targeted so there is a threat to the Uh, the SFIR report says that there's a threat to the country also. Good question. They are not legal at all. They've been banned. There. But it has to be law and order is a state subject, as you know. So state governments have to take action. And also, I feel uh, Bollywood celebrities also should be more responsible. We can't pinpoint any lobby as such, but I would say it's a systemic failure.